you know, this election was a local council election. I didn't go into it arguing it was all about independence. So I'm not going to come out of it and argue somehow retrospectively that it was all about independence. People in any election will vote for a whole variety of reasons. In this election, I think they were voting uh, principally because they want more action on the cost of living crisis and they want to see the Westminster government step up. So it was a strong message on that. But the SNP vote share went up. Obviously, the leading pro-independence party. And the, after the SNP, the next big winners, I think, were the Greens, pro-independence supporting party. So I think that's significant and we take a lot of heart from it. So it, it wasn't. We won a mandate for a referendum this time last year. Preparations for that are underway. Um, it's certainly having a victory of the scale we had yesterday, with the Greens doing relatively well too. It certainly doesn't harm the case for an independence referendum, but that case was not resting on the outcome of the council elections. Um, but certainly it hasn't done it any harm. Uh, over the coming weeks, we'll set the dates when we decide the exact dates to publish these papers, but people are going to see the argument, the debate uh, for independence really pick up pace in the weeks to come.